This is an in-depth tour of the 2006 Ford Freestar Limited. It has a chrome grille. It also has turning lamps. These are not fog lamps. The Freestar also comes with 17 inch polished alloys. It also has turn signal in integrated mirrors. The specific model does not have heated mirrors, however, Freestars do come with them. It also has a keyless entry pad. Around back you see the 4.2 liter badge, that's because this vehicle has the 4.2 liter V6 engine. It also has an, the advanced drive package, which features traction control, rear parking sensors, and a advanced track ESP system. This is the limited edition model, which is a top of the line model. It starts at SE, SEL, and then limited, which is this vehicle. As you can see here, there are puddle lamps, so once you exit out of the vehicle, you can see what you're stepping into. These are the settings for the memory seat controls. It has two settings. These are the controls for the mirrors, lock and unlock buttons, and the window switch controls. You have the controls for the headlight, the dial that uh, adjusts the brightness of the dash, and the pedal adjuster. You also have um, an analog clock which comes with the limited trim. You have this gorgeous wood trim in the front of the vehicle, which looks fabulous. You have a screen in the middle of the dash, and you can adjust it with these buttons. So when I press info, I can cycle through all of its features. Uh, set. So I have 332 miles to empty, trip odometer, uh, average MPG, trip time, I can time it, or if I want nothing at all, I can have that. And the, it has a column shifter instead of a regular traditional shifter. You have cup holders here, as well as a storage compartment. It also has two 12 volt plug-ins. There's also a storage compartment and with the advanced track package comes tractor control and rear parking sensors. It does not have front parking sensors. There's three buttons here which uh, open, which you can program to open and close garage doors and etc. To the right of that you have buttons which allow you to open and close the sliding doors and the tailgate. You have a child watcher mirror right here, which you can use to look at your rear passengers. Here, there's a screen which shows you the outside temperature and the direction you're facing. You can uh, turn this on or off. This is, these are the buttons for the rear vents, which basically open and close the rear window windows. As you can see here in the steering system, you have a CD player. You, this is the knob that you use to turn up and down the volume as well as turn it off. And here, when you click menu, you can cycle through bass, treble, you can adjust where the sound comes from in the speakers, auto set, speed set, so basically as you go higher and higher speeds, the volume of the audio will also increase, and then you can just go to regular volume and it will show you your volume. These are the buttons that you can use for the presets, as well as the cassette player and the CD player, for example, you can rewind, uh, fast forward, repeat the track, etc, etc. And if you want to go to preset 2, you can go there to preset 3, preset 1, whatever you want. So as you can see in the climate control system, you have automatic climate controls. Which you can click for automatic climate controls. You can turn it off, front to frost, rear to frost. Um, you also have AC recirculating. You can select how much air comes in the front and the rear. Um, where you want the air to come, as well as heated seats with two levels. And you can even select the temperature in the back. And it's a dual zone uh, climate control system. There's also a center console with storage here and here. This is the DVD player. So this is the screen and you just have to put a CD in here and you can watch whatever you want. It comes with two headphones and one remote. Now here there are climate control dials for the rear which can only be adjusted if 
this button is pressed and so now I'm adjusting it uh, you have controls here volume media um, headphones preset and changing to radio stations these are headphone jacks all you have to do is just pull this lever and the seat folds down and now you're back here so back here you have two cup holders a storage area as well as here a cup one cup holder and one storage area have a floor vent so when I adjust it here when I put it floor and I put uh, here air blows through the floor vent 